Hey guys, what's going on? Gazzy Mexican here, and this video is kind of a special video for you guys. Um, I get a lot of questions from you asking me what equipment uh, to use, what software and stuff like that, especially a lot of times it's people asking me about PC gaming and what's the best software out there or a good piece of software that's not super expensive to use to record PC games. And this video happens to touch on that very subject, recording PC games. Um, a company named Marillis contacted me a little while back asking me to check out their program uh, called Action, and I did, and it's surprisingly a very good program. So they said, you know, if I liked it, feel free to do a review video and, uh, you know, check it out and share it with you guys. So that's exactly what I'm doing, because I do believe that it is a very good program, and I want to show you guys how easy it is to use and the quality that it kicks out. So, with that being said, let's get to it. So, right off the bat, the first thing I noticed about Action was the nice looking interface that was also easy to use and navigate. It didn't take me very long to figure out how to work the program and allowed me to delve right into doing some recording, and that's big with me. If it takes me too long to figure out how to use a program, then I've already begun to lose interest in even using it. The main screen of Action is the Video Recording tab. It allows you to switch between the three different modes, Games, Active Desktop, and Active Desktop Region. It also shows you your recordings on the left. And since it's probably what most of you would use anyways, let's get right into the regular game overlay recording mode. It works pretty much like you'd imagine. Click the controller and now you'll see an overlay in the corner of your game that shows when you're recording or not, as well as the frames you're getting. As you can see, the video quality of the recordings you get with Action are pretty damn good. Your recording resolution can be changed from 480p, 720p, and 1080p or the original size option. Frame rates can go all the way up to 60 frames a second. What you're seeing right now is 1080p at 60 FPS. You'd think recording at 60 frames in 1080p would leave you with huge file sizes, but surprisingly they're not that bad. Action does a nice job balancing quality with encoding the video efficiently, reducing file sizes compared to many other programs out there. As mentioned before, Action also has two other recording modes that allow you to either record your desktop or just a region of your desktop making it a nice tool for making tutorials. I've actually been using it to show you the program in this video. The desktop region recording mode is nice for when you'd like to record browser-based games. Here's an example of one that's on Congregate that I recorded. I used the region mode to record this, and it worked just fine. Action does lack a little bit of customization options, such as the ability to add multiple sources of input for audio, and it can't be used as a streaming tool in the way that DxTory can. However, it does allow you to record your mic as well as the game sound for commentaries, just like Fraps does. Everything you'd need to record high-quality gameplay is there, and it's very easy to use. And its price at $30 makes it cheaper than some of the other programs that are out there that do the same thing. Overall, I'd say Action is a nice solution for anybody who's looking to record high-quality PC gameplay and doesn't want to have to use anything that's too complex. With its straightforward and easy-to-understand interface, it's pretty simple for anyone to start recording gameplay moments after installing. For 30 bucks, I'd say Action is a pretty good deal, and would recommend any of you considering buying a program to record PC gameplay to consider Marillis' Action as a choice. Well, that's pretty much it, guys. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, thanks to Marillis for letting me check out their program. I didn't even know that um, this program existed, and like I said in the video, maybe there's some of you guys out there that were considering buying um, a PC gameplay recording program, and um, now you know that this is out there. So. Thanks for watching, and a side note that I wanted to mention, they make also another program, Marillus I'm talking about, they make another program called Splash EX Pro, and it's primarily a uh, video player, like an HD video player that like plays it really fast and smooth and stuff like that, but what I found it can do, and it's been very helpful for me, is I use my iPhone 4S sometimes to vlog and stuff when I don't feel like bringing my big hulking camera, you know what I mean, that I'm recording right now with. Um, and that program has an export feature. It's only the EX Pro version that has that, but I figured I'd mention it anyways because I use it all the time now. Um, it exports uh, the .mov files from iPhone 4S into a more usable and uh, video editor program friendly format of .mp4, and it does it very fast. I suppose you could even use the, that um, export function on Splash EX Pro to, um, to even further compress the uh, files from Action. So I've never really done that much, but I figured I'd mention it to you guys because I figured a lot of you guys out there probably have an iPhone 4S. Maybe you're trying to do vlogging or maybe you just want a usable format that works better in video editors um, from your iPhone. And that was the problem that I had. The, uh, the .mov didn't really work that well. So yeah, that program does that really well. I'll have the link to that as well 
as the uh, action program in the description. And since Marillas are awesome, they gave me a link that'll knock off five bucks if you guys do decide to buy the program. So thanks to them for uh, hooking me up with that link and giving you guys a little bit of discount if you did like the program. Um, that's pretty much it. I think you can try their program on their site if you want, you know, before you buy. Same cool whole deal as you would expect. But thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. And I'll see you later.